Yo, what's up guys? Um, I'm gonna show you a Emic speed farm unkillable team. It is technically not unkillable because Iron Twin can ignore that one, but he is. I made him tanky in a regeneration set and he also put shields out there. So he, he will survive until the breaking point is there and the boss is dead. So that is pretty much insane. And yeah, we got two DPSs in here that makes it like unbelievably fast you can imagine replacements in here we could put a cold heart with a g nut a nude or a geomancer oh no no geomancer needs to be like that like he is i think the best spot in there and if you want to make it like for real unkillable unkillable for like 500 turns you could use instead of a cold heart just another um support champion who can cover um amix so that is an option too. For example, you could go for more resistance on Emic, put a OLA in here and put the increased resistance out there. And basically he cannot die anymore because he won't get those debuffs anymore. And he can just survive by, by him own with the shield and stuff. So, but I want to show you how I found that team because yes, it was not dis discovered by me, like by myself not at all and here we are in the software and how did i discover it i used the software i used the iron twins calculator put all my champions in here selected them and then i went on the next bar and here we got turns unbelievably high and on turn one i gave everybody an unkillable on the next turn i selected all i gave everybody an unkillable and i went i, I did only 15 turns then I went like and on every tab and I pressed unkillable. I went for the search function in the software. Also, this is like the, a big promotion for this one because <laughs> like the team you will see in a second is amazing. And I pressed the start button right here and it gave me speeds. Of course, at the moment it is super tight and it will pop up like immediately because yeah, the speeds are super tight, but that will take a little longer to actually show you sometimes uh, some numbers. But if you get numbers, then you go in here, like you press the little button over there and it will bring you, oh, I'm not gonna do it right now because it will break my example right now. And then you go over here and it will be in here. And you see what it actually did for you in my case, it is unkillable the whole time like you see right there and yeah technically it isn't because iron twin can um ignore that but if you are tanky enough you can just take it and you are good and we only have one turn on this whole thing where we're like not unkillable on on counters that is the third turn but there is actually just just a pain keeper doing one hit and i think we won't get on the perfect hp bar and we don't got war master so i think that turn is okay and everything else is just unkillable the whole time but you know what i mean you gotta be tanky and you gotta hit take something so in my case i wanted to be like super fast let's go back into the game wait let me check if we are actually on the game nice so because i got limited uh, examples i already used like a couple gems to like refill and yeah i'm gonna show you the preset <coughs> sorry and because it is really kind of strange like look at that one like here we got the, the like you maybe think of but the next pain keeper is like uh what <laughs> yeah it's like a, a priority on one on his a2 and that makes it work we got an opener here crazy crazy and it's just made by a software just waiting typing in your champions and wait for it of course you, you gotta think a little bit for yourself like which champions you want unkillable or not unkillable how am i gonna avoid the one hit which ignores unkillable and stuff like that you, you of course you gotta think about that so um that's all about the presets you already saw also in the calculator the preset so um let's go and do all my runs uh can i yeah oh i uh, i kind of knew it because i got like internet problems right now but yeah i will be back in a second so i'm um, back and i hope my internet is right there all righty so um i want to mention like at the moment this one could fail for me maybe 
I haven't tested too much, so maybe if there's, if there's something wrong right now, it is not because the, the speed tune is wrong, it is because I don't have enough HP or my emic or defense or something else, maybe defiance set, a healer in here, something like that. But <laughs> do you see like how the boss is melting right now? Like, oh, yeah. <laughs> uh, that's, that's the juicy tea. <laughs> yes um yeah i really do like this comp it is super quick it is not stable for a hundred million turns but on the end <laughs> who kind of cares if the boss is dead you know and yeah amazing stuff like we're gonna watch the few other runs maybe <coughs> it's a little bit slower maybe it's a little bit quicker who knows? It's just my keys for the day, who I got left. And you actually see, like, what's going to happen. This time I think it's a little bit slower. Maybe I was talking a little bit too much in the first one or something like that. I don't know. I, I really love this comp, man. And the software literally gave me, like, that. you have the idea, you put it in the software, and it gives you, it gives you the numbers, or, and... If there are no numbers, it's actually not possible. <sighs> so I um, my doorbell a couple times, but yeah, excuse me that. So another time the boss like, it's always under a minute for now. Like maybe this, ah, okay, okay. <laughs> it's not always under a minute. It is sometimes exactly a minute. So one more run and I will hit out. Um, maybe I'm gonna show you like um, my MX for a second because he's kind of important. The other ones, they don't have levels like Painkeepers, Geomancer. You just need the speed and the accuracy. It's 550 what you need on your um, Geomancer, but the speeds are slow. The Cold Heart, of course, 70 crit rate and as much crit damage as you can pump into. So I'm gonna just show you my Amix because he's like the important guy. He makes it work or not work. Yeah. So, 50% <laughs> already down. Amazing stuff. Like, oh. This software makes my, my life so much easier. Oh. I think my Amix isn't like tanky enough at this point. Like, when the Iron Twin ignores the, the unkillable of your Amix, it he will also ignore the unkillable of your other team. So, eh, let's go ahead and do it one more time. So, you, you see, something can be, like, even go better in my case. I think it's all because of Amix. I just need to build him a little bit more. You can do the run a little bit slower, but then you just put a Oella in here. She's gonna heal you, the resistance up. If you, a bad example is like a helicaf, like that's like maybe if you don't have one painkeeper or something more or something, but you can find something in here to to actually make Emix like more tanky, increase defense, strengthen something. Really, everything helps in here. And then you just have the geomancer in there, and it will take a little longer, but hey, who cares? Actually, who cares if you just have an Emix and you want to do it? Go ahead and do it. You, put, you can put the G nut in here. <laughs> and everything is okay because the damage will be insane. Like, But of course you got affinity problems sometimes. But on the end I got a super quick MX team and I do like it. Maybe I do some more HP, a little bit more defense and yeah, accuracy or something. Resistance I don't think I can pump so much in, in him without the Oella or resistance up. But it, you can consider that one so um let's check out the amix the other ones they're just basically speed and accuracy on your geomancer and crit rate and crit damage on your code heart so actually just speed manners and you can find them all in the presets that's like a little bit more easy for you so where is my amix right there so he is already in a regeneration and an immortal set and yeah, maybe you can level up something in here so he can put he's a little bit more tanky, but overall he is a really good tank. 
Now, don't get me wrong. We got 93,000 HP, 3,300 defense, and the rest kind of doesn't matter besides the speed. It's 252. So I could go a little bit more defense in here. I can put a decrease, decrease defense, not, not decrease, increase defense champions next to him, and he will be good on his defense. He will not die anymore. Uh, maybe some replacements on DPSs. A ninja is maybe better than a cold heart or something. But I don't want to like show you with a ninja and you're all like boo, boo. <laughs> so um. Masteries I actually do not have. Maybe it is better to not have that one. I don't know. I don't think so. It makes literally no change if he counterattacks or not. But yeah, that could be a thing. And maybe like that one. I don't know if it interferes sometimes with your shield that you already got or something. Maybe that one not. But on the end, just have him booked 252 speed as tanky as you can. And might bring another champ that covers you or just makes you unkillable or something like maybe a dim yeah, okay a dim if i wouldn't work but you you get the point so um it was all about this amazing comp and i hope maybe some someone comes in makes it better i, I would be be honored that somebody comes and makes it better it's easier for my life for your for your life and yeah that was all about mx and i hope i see you in the next video and yeah have a nice day